The following video demonstrates posterior labral repair utilizing a knot less all suture technique. Here are our relevant disclosures. Diagnostic arthroscopy is performed in the lateral position demonstrating a posterior labral tear on a left shoulder. A standard posterior lateral portal is used to visualize while an anterior portal is utilized to aggressively liberate and debride the frayed labrum edge back to a stable tear pattern. An accessory posterior lateral portal as described by Romeo and Proventure is performed and then view is switched to an anterior viewing position to view posteriorly both the standard posterior lateral portal and the accessory posterior lateral portal. An anchor can then be placed through either portal at the arthroscopist's description and sutures shuttled appropriately. After the labral repair stitch has been shuttled, the labral repair stitch can then be passed through the knotless mechanism of the anchor and tensioned down appropriately. Importantly, the tensioning stitch is maintained and not cut so as to allow for sequential retensioning after placement of additional anchors. Here a three anchor posterior labral repair has been performed and we can see that by preserving the tensioning stitch from each anchor we are able to go back and sequentially retension allowing for our appropriate restoration of a labral bumper and then the sutures can be cut flush demonstrating a final repair construct. Thank you very much for your time and your attention.